Hey, what's up guys? 98 Sports Talk here. So let's take a look at Auburn's FPI, ESPN FPI rankings. And I've done a video on uh, each, uh, each school. So go again, check those out. I'm releasing them at different times. They're fun to look at. So let's dive in. And, and also want to mention, I'm going to talk about uh, ESPN gives a schedule prediction at the end, a ranking prediction. So stay tuned for the end. Uh, but let's go through the schedule and the percent chances that Auburn has of winning each game on its schedule according to ESPN. So let's get into it here. Um, first game, this is, this is a big game for the SEC, you know, SEC versus those uh, left coasters uh, in Washington. Auburn is actually a very, very, very slight underdog. ESPN's got them with a 49.5% chance of winning the game. So basically a 50-50 shot at winning the game. Um, I, you know, I think Auburn should be slightly favored uh, in this one, but you know, I'm an SEC homer too. So, you know, what can I say? Uh, I do think Washington will have a pretty decent team this coming year, but I, but I do think Auburn wins that game. Next game is Alabama State, 99.9% .9 chance of winning that one. Can't argue that. LSU, th this one just seems pretty high to me. Uh, ESPN's giving Auburn an 86, or excuse me, 82.6% chance to beat LSU at home. That just, that just seems high. 82.6, almost 83%. That's kind of high to me. Uh, next one up is uh, got, Auburn's got Arkansas at home, a 91.7% chance. Okay, I can go with that one. Southern Miss, 98.4. Good on that one. Next one is on the road at Mississippi State. Auburn's given a 57.9% chance of winning that game. We'll see how good Joe Moorhead and uh, uh, has Mississippi State playing. I, you know, Right now, I can't really argue with that one. Tennessee's next up with a 89.9% .9 chance to win that one. I think that's fine. At Ole Miss with a 79.6 chance to win that game. I think that one's fine as well. A&M is next up with an 81% chance to win that game. That's good. Next three are, are well, the next, two out of the three are, are the big ones on Auburn's schedule. Georgia, it has Auburn a 33% chance to win that game. Um, I, you know, I think that's a little bit low. I think Auburn's got a little, you know, better than a 33% chance to win that one. Uh, next game is Liberty, 99% chance they'll beat Liberty. And then Bama. This is kind of interesting too as well because it basically lists uh, Auburn's chances against Georgia and Alabama as pretty much the exact same. Georgia was 33.3. Alabama is 33.2% chance to win that game. And the same thing I thought uh, with the Georgia game. I think Auburn's got a little bit better chance to win that game than just 33.2%. So uh, that's kind of what I think about the uh, breakdown on the schedule there. And let's get into what ESPN predicts Auburn to be um, at the end of the year. Uh, they, they got them uh, ranked seventh at the end of the year. Their projected win-loss is 9.1 wins and 3.1 losses based on, on that. Um, you know, I, I, think, I think Auburn's going to be in that range. You know, the Georgia... And Alabama games are going to be really tough games. LSU is going to be a tough one. I think Mississippi State could be a really tough game. So nine and three, you know, I, I think that's probably a pretty good prediction for Auburn. Auburn's chance of winning out is 0.7%, so virtually no chance of winning out there. Um, and their chance of winning the conference, Auburn is the uh, the third highest ranked team to. Uh, win the uh, SEC championship, according to ESPN. Georgia's number one, followed by Alabama at number two, and then Auburn is at 11% to win the conference. And I, I think that's a, uh, a fair number on, uh, on Auburn. So let me know what you guys think about ESPN's, um, you know, rankings here. You know, do you think those, some of those percentages are a bit low? Um, you know, let me know down in the comments. And also, if you haven't done so, smash that subscribe button. Let's build up this SEC community. And I'll see you guys in the next video.